metastatic patients, well, the, the standard first-line treatment has changed. Um, we saw at ESMO in the plenary session, Tom Post presenting the data of the EV302 trial. In the EV302 trial, well, the combination of an antibody drug conjugase targeting nectin 4 which is called enfortumab edotin, in combination with a PD-1 inhibitor, pembrolizumab, demonstrated to be superior in everything, all the endpoints related to activity. Responses, complete radiological responses, median progression-free survival, and the most important thing, median overall survival. Um, this is the first time that a phase three trial, something, some combination, some drug, is beating the standard cisplatin-based chemotherapy or carbo-based chemotherapy we have been using for decades in this field. I think this is something very exciting. I think this is a breakthrough in the field of metastatic urothelial carcinoma. Now, uh, with this new option, enfortumab edotin uh, plus pembrolizumab, our patients, the um, how we are considering these patients in terms of palliative or maybe curative, you know, from now, uh, they can be considered in a long term, in a long term, because the median expected survival is around three years, almost three years. So you have a lot of things to do with these patients. And don't forget that around one third of the patients, they are achieving a complete radiological response. And the median duration of these patients in which the duration, the, the, the radiological response was complete, was not met. Uh, after a long uh, follow-up time. So I think these are very good news for patients. I think this co new combination is practice changing. And I think that uh, now we should start to talk about eligibility to receive enfortumab rather than eligibility to receive cisplatin. Cisplatin and carboplatin will be replaced from the first-line treatment. Other thing is to talk about the access, to talk about the cost of these new combinations. I don't know in your country, but in a country like Spain, it's, it's going to be a pain to, to get the reimbursement for this new combination.